We often celebrate nurses, teachers, firefighters, but sometimes there are jobs that go unnoticed. Well, I headed to the Cascade County Detention Center to show you one profession that needs a little recognition. To do this job, you have to have a certain sense of community safety and, you're, and you're, you're doing something for your community. Inside these walls are more than just inmates. There's the people that spend day in and day out working to keep our community safe. It's a misunderstood profession. The correction officers at the Cascade County Detention Center walk into their 12-hour shift every day to a new task. When we walk into work every day, it's a lot of it's unexpected. It's kind of what's, um, you know, every day changes here. Uh, the people that we get, the people that are in, our, that we house in our facility that leave, um, including the, the different issues that people have when they do come in. And oftentimes it's not an easy one. You know, right now we're dealing with a lot of mental, mental health issues, a lot of people with medical issues, um, sub, substance abuse issues, and, and it's, it's not easy. It's a revolving door. You see a lot of the same people. And uh, you know, you, and, and you feel bad for them, but at the same time, you want them to get the help that they need. And sometimes being here is, is, is the help that they need. But sometimes there is a light at the end of the tunnel. When we can get somebody that exits our facility and they don't come back, I mean, there is kind of a feel-good story behind it. It's very thankless, but, but, but it, at the same time, it is very rewarding. And what can we 